Today, News 1130 is celebrating 25 years of breaking news, traffic and weather. But before that, and for nearly as long, CKWX was home to the high lonesome sounds of Johnny Cash and Willie Nelson, among others. Yes, from 1973 to 1996, the 1130 frequency served up country music with generous helpings of news and information programming on the side. But by the early 90s, the party was pretty much over for music, country or otherwise, on the AM dial. The ratings weren't bad, but it was an older audience that was hard to monetize. They were talking about, you know, what do you do with these AM stations? And, and they had become aware of a station in New York City called 1010 Winds, which was all news and had pioneered the concept of the news wheel. And they'd been listening to it and they'd been watching its success. And they decided that this was something they were going to do. They'd already flipped uh, their Toronto radio station, uh, 680 News, using the same sort of philosophy and product design. So I think it was, it was coming and it was kind of the way of things, but it was still sad. The last record we played would be Ray Price for the good times, and as it faded out, up came the clackety-clack sound of the teletype, and then our original news director, Tom Mark, came on the air to read that first newscast at 8 a.m. sharp. All news, all day, all night. This is Vancouver's only 24-hour news. CKWX News 11:30. This is Thursday, February 8th, 1996. Good morning. I'm Tom Mark in Vancouver. It's six degrees and cloudy. There were critics. This isn't going to last. They said we'll give it maybe a year, maybe two. No one's going to want to listen to all news radio, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. But we proved them wrong. And 25 years later, we remain Vancouver's only 24-hour all-news radio station. We've been there with you through good times and bad, through triumph and tragedy, through heat waves and snowstorms, and we're still with you today. And we're not just on the radio. We are wherever you look for news. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and online at citynews1130.com. From News 1130, I'm John Ackerman, City News.